Hi, this is a mathematics uh, tutorial, very tutorial we're going to be discussing about the factors and multiple of a number. In the first place, let's find out what does it, what do we mean by factor, the factors, okay, in the first place, you see factor is cells, we can always say of a number is a number that divides that number exactly well, that's factor and now what about the multiple in the case of multiple we can say multiple a multiple of a number is is a number obtained by multiplying by multiplying that number by any other natural any other natural number okay let's take a good look at these two definitions the factor of a number is a number that divides that number exactly. An example of this factor is you, we can say 3. 3 is a factor of 6. We can also say 3. 3 itself is also a factor of 18. Let's check out 7. 7 is a factor of 56. What about 13? 13 is a factor of 104. We can double check this by using our calculator. Okay, we all know that 3 is also a factor of 18. 7 is a factor of 56. And 13 is a factor of 104 so you go look at your calculator and you find that to be correct okay let's move on what about an example for the multiple in the first place the multiple of a number is a number obtained by multiplying that number by any other natural number so example of multiple numbers can be I say 6 is a multiple of 3 and as well we can also say 18 is a multiple of 3 56 is a multiple of 7 and 104 is a multiple of 13 now, what I'll do next is just to show you guys some uh, or try out one or two activities and see if you guys can get that right. Since we now have an idea what factors are and what multiples are. Okay, in this very exercise, what we will do next is to have a go at the following. Okay, let's say list all the factors of 12. So we list out all the factors of 12. Maybe we should just put it there, right underneath. Then uh, we also have a go at all the factors of 50. And uh, then we we'll finish up with listing out all the factors of 64 there so the factors of 12 you have a go at that then I will come back and just show you guys the answer to the following so all the factors of 12 all the factors of 50 and all the factors of 
54 so I'll be right back with you okay if your answer is one two three four six and twelve that is correct okay all the factors of 50 1 2 5 10 25 and 50 that will be correct and for 64 if you say all your factors are 1 2 4 8 16 32 and 64 that will be correct here are the factors of 12 let's change the color so that you can see it properly the factors of 50 and the factors of 69 okay in this next um, exercise we are to list the first four multiple of 10 and the first eight multiple of 5 then which numbers are common to both lists so if we have a look I suppose you've all uh, worked that out by now the first four multiples of 10 are as follows 10 if you guess and say 20 that will be right 30 and 4 that answers the very first question the first four multiple of 10 now let's list the first eight multiples of five the first eight multiple of five let's give that a try Okay, the first eight multiple of fives that would include, we say, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty and 40 is the first eight multiple of fives so let's change the color to represent the first eight multiple of five now which numbers are common to both the common numbers to both i believe you've all figured that out by now the common numbers to both are you can see we have 10 here and we also have 10 here which means 10 is common to both we have 20 we have 20 here and there's 20 here 20 is common to both we have 30 here and we also have 30 here 30 is common to both and finally we have 40 here and 40 right here which means 40 is also common to both and that answers our first activity for today so i will call it a day right now and now i'll be back to you guys with more tutorial so you all have a nice day now